Hello beautiful people, yeah, welcome back again to the channel. It's your boy Sunny Media. Please, if this is your first time on my channel, please can you hit on the subscribe button down below. Tap on the bell, post notifications. So anytime I post a new video, you'll be the first person to be notified. Also, give the video a thumbs up. Give your comments in the comment section, guys. In today's video, it's about a reaction video. Let's watch this video carefully. Just listen to whatever all these guys. I don't know whether they are small boys, Nigerian small boys, or uh big boys, like I don't actually know their age, just I just saw them online and I stumble on their videos on what they are saying. And I say, let me share it with you guys here on this uh, YouTube space for you to put mouth. Let's talk about it, guys. Just watch the video, guys, and let's come back and talk. For for a Nigeria to work in Ghana, they need a work permit. Mm. Imagine they need a work permit. As they came to Nigeria, did they did they ask them to 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 get work permit before they give the permit them to come? <laughs> Hold on, guys. The video has not finished yet. There's another one you will watch after watching that one. Then we'll talk about them all together. Just you know, hold on with this one. Watch one this of one. my friend traveled to Ghana, <laughs> and he did not get any work. There's no work in Ghana or Nigerian that always traveling to Ghana. What is in Ghana that Nigerian don't have? Is Na is Ghana the only African country in this world? There are there are many works and opportunities in in Nigeria. But Nigerians are always traveling to Ghana. Why? All the people I have known have traveled to Ghana. If you ask them what is in the Ghana they are going to find, they will say I will not understand. What is there to understand? Is Nigeria the, is Ghana the only African country in this world? If you call this person, he go tell you Ghana, Ghana, Ghana. If you ask them what is inside the Ghana, they are going to find. They will say, guy, you will not understand. Is Ghana the only African country, or there is something else they are looking for there? Is it electricity? Other African countries have electricity. Togo have electricity. Um, Kenya have electricity. Gambia have electricity. Almost all the whole African countries in this world have electricity. What is in Ghana that they are looking for? Guy, what are you, what is, is there work in Ghana? What, what are you looking for there? You tell me, you will not understand. It is high time we locate to other countries. <laughs> That's not all yet. I want you to keep this one too. Watch this one too. I heard that Ghanaians are saying there's no Ghanaians in Nigeria yet. Why do you say so? Come to Nigeria here. Yeah. Come to Delta State Asaba. You see many Ghanaians in Nigeria here. Yeah. So then I always see them in the road. Selling buff buff. Doing sort of things to gain income. So they are even renting our houses. Teaching our students. Can I just argue that there is no Ghanaians in Nigeria? Let them come to Asaba. Let them go to Lagos, Agege. Let them go to River State. Especially River State and Lagos and Asaba here. You see them many. I always see them when I want to go and buy um, food in restaurant. I see them. Well, I see one of them selling food. I didn't, I didn't mind to ask people. I already know it's a Ghanaian. It's really how he talks. And the kind of work they like to do is they like to build houses, say both look like buff buff and so on. Teach our students. Even imagine you teach our own students. So they say they will never go back to their country back again. They want to go back again. They want to stay here in Nigeria. And Nigeria is better than their country. So guys, so these are all the videos. So now let's talk about it. Let's react. You can drop in the comment section what you Think about this video, these three videos I showed you. Okay, let's start with the first one. The first person said that before you work in Ghana as a Nigerian, you need that, like, they need your working permit. Yes, working permit. The way she said it, <laughs> listen to her again. For, for a Nigerian to work in Ghana, they need a work permit. Hmm? Imagine, they need a work permit. As they came to Nigeria, did they did they ask them to 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 get work permit before they give the permit then to go? It's not only about Nigerians that are requires a working permit before they could work in Ghana. Even uh, other foreigners too. It's the same thing. Yeah, 
So don't make it as if uh, he's only Nigerians. So even I don't know if I'm right on that. Yeah, is or my fellow Ghanaians, is it only Nigerians that requires working permit before they could work in Ghana? No, I don't think so. It's not only Nigerians. So all the foreigners will suffice you not to Ghanaian before you can work in Ghana here. You need a working permit. That is the law. That is the procedure. If you want to follow the due process, you know. Another thing is, does this kind of thing exist in Nigeria too? This kind of law, this kind of procedures. Yes, is the answer. It's like that too in Nigeria. Before you could work as in a, in Nigeria, you also need as a foreigner, you need a working permit. But just that Nigeria, they are not taking their own serial like their own law is not in effect. It is not effective. Like, let's just put it that way. It's not effective at all. But the law is there. The whole procedures, everything, they are all there in Nigerian system too. You get. So it, it, it don't even even in other countries, uh, Benin Republic, um, Kenya, everywhere is like that. If I'm not mistaken, you can drop in the comment section if it's not so. We are all learning every day. But for me, I think. If you want to work in another person country, you must need some necessary uh, requirements, some papers, some documents that you know at least you get. So this girl, uh, she is not saying that uh, all the Ghanaians in Nigeria working, did they ask them for working permit? You get. So that is you that is in Nigeria. You in Nigeria. Like if you want them for to have working permit, you tell them. You get so not not if you see a country telling them for working permit star you know <laughs> you get so you can drop in the comment what you know about this too let's talk about the other one the other would i say is a is, is a small boy that's talking like that or is a grown-up person i don't actually know whether he's a grown-up person or is a small boy but from his stature from his way looking sasha it seems as a small boy Okay. He said that uh, he don't know why the Nigerians always go into Ghana. That they, we have other African countries like Kotonu, which is Benin Republic. Have Togo, we have uh, Kenya, we have there are some African countries. I think he made mention of right. So why only Ghana that Nigerians always travel and go? What do you think about this? So the guy, the boy or the guy was also saying that uh, is it because of the light? Ghana is having constant electricity, constant light. Uh, uh, other African countries are also having a, a constant light. Light, like he made mention of uh, Benin Republic, made mention of Kenya, made mention of some countries in Africa that also uh, enjoy two four seven electricity. Why not move into all those countries? Why only Ghana? And he said that he asked one of his friends if there's any work in Ghana. I said there's no work in Ghana. Why are they now going to Ghana if there's no work? But in Nigeria, there are work, there are many works you can do this and this, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so, what do you have to say? As for me, Nigerians are coming to Ghana. The first people that came to Ghana discovered that uh, things are quite kind of expensive in Ghana. Like when you bring some things or some goods or some stuff to Ghana, you sell it. In a high price, you get, and the money, the Ghana money is also the like it's like dollar. Yes, Ghana money is like dollar. Like when you have cities and changes to naira, you have more naira. You get. So the first people that the first Nigerians that discovered Ghana, they brought their goods inside Ghana. Then let's say they bought goods of hundred thousand naira, and they came to Ghana and said that after selling the goods, they will be having in their hand five hundred thousand naira. The goods you bought 100,000 naira after selling it in Ghana, you get 500,000 naira. Then you go again and buy another one, you, your money keep doubling. You see the reason why so many of them started moving to Ghana? Because they discovered that when they go to Ghana and they sell the uh, goods in a high price, you get. So when they change the money, when they change the cities to naira, the naira will become everywhere. In Naira, we become f like full all the whole ground. You get so. I think that was the reason Nigerians appeared, you know, shifting to Ghana because of that. Their money is like dollar. When they change it to Naira, it becomes plenty. 
market and also the goods when they sell it in Ghana, they sell it in high yield. Because in Nigeria, things are relatively cheaper. Cheap, 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 you know? But when you go to another country where things are more expensive and you sell those your goods, then you have more money. So you see the reason why Ghana, Nigerians are coming to Ghana is not like uh, in Kotonou, like uh, in Federal Republic, it's not like that. You get so Ghana, their money is is let's say let's just say, say the truth, their money is good. You get their money is like just like dollar. Like you know, when you have a hundred dollar, when you have a hundred dollar, you know in Naira, you know what it means. You know the what hundred dollar can buy many things, right? That is how CDC is too. The only thing is that that dollar, when you are in the country that spend dollar like US, the dollar is nothing, but it's something in Nigeria. Likewise, in, in cities, hundred cities cannot buy a lot of things in 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 in, um, in Ghana, but when you change it to naira, it can buy a lot of things in Nigeria. Yeah, so that is how it is. Like that, the cities is like dollar. You know, when you are in a country that spend cities or spend dollar. You know, the, the money will not buy a lot of things, but when you change it to Naira, it become too much money and you can use it to buy a lot of things. And not only Ghana, that uh, Nigerians are moving, Nigerians are moving to any, every other African country. You go to Kenya, the, 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 the boy or the man or the guy said, mentioned, you see a lot of Nigerians there. Go to Benin Republic, there are many Nigerians. There is, there is like Nigerians spread all over, not only Ghana, but just that. Ghana, eh, eh, just that the, the, the reason why eh, Nigerians are being heard more in Ghana is because of this banter. We are bantering online. Jello from Jello to stew from stew to pepper from pepper to soup and light soup and uh, stew and music and all this, you know, online bantering. That is why um, it seems as if it's only Ghana that Nigerians are moving. No. Nigerians are all over other African countries. Maybe nobody they hear about those ones. You get can drop in the comment section what else you know or what what you want you want to say regarding the video. You get <laughs> you know we are all reacting on the video together. So put your own reactions in the comment section. So now let's talk about the last video. The guy was saying that um, Ghanaians were saying, the Ghanaians are saying that uh, there's no Ghanaians in Nigeria anymore. You know? And the, the boy was like saying that, ah, you people lie. So he was like saying that uh, there are many Ghanaians in Nigeria. Are you saying that there's no Ghanaians in Nigeria that you are lying? You are lying saying there's no uh, Ghanaians in Nigeria. Ghanaians are everywhere in Nigeria. So that was what he was saying in his own video. Like he mentioned no mention of Agege in a Lagos state. If you go there, say there's many Ghanaians there. Maybe when I travel to Nigeria again, maybe I'll go to that Agege and see if it's true. And I'm not sure. But if it's true, let us know in the comment section. No mention of Asaba. Asaba in Delta State. Say there's many Ghanaians there. No mention of Kalaba. No mention of some places like that in Nigeria. There are many Ghanaians there. They also say that the, the job they are doing there is teaching, like teaching, like being teachers, like teaching in a school and also building, building houses and um, also uh, some people selling uh, both, like the one we call in Ghana, both road and things like that. So you were saying that there are a lot of uh, Ghanaians in Nigeria. And he also said that uh, those, those Ghanaians in Nigeria say that they will never go back to Ghana because Nigeria economy is more better. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Guys, what do you have to say about this? So, in my own humble opinion about this one, see, I've seen some, I will not say so many, I've seen, I've seen some Ghanaians in Nigeria though, but I've not seen them many, plenty like that with my eyes, like the way people are saying there are many, many Ghanaians in Nigeria. I have not seen plenty. It's only few I have seen. Yeah, 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 yeah. For me, for me, it's only few. So, how many have you seen in Nigeria? Let us know in the comment section because this one they are saying there are many Ghanaians in Nigeria. Because, come to think of, of it, many Nigerians are moving away from Nigeria to Ghana. And why Ghanaians are also moving to Nigeria? I don't understand. Does that make sense? Does that seem to be true? If it's true, you can drop in the comment, guys. Let's discuss about it. For selling of both fruit, I think it's before. 
the Ghanaians usually go to Nigeria and they are selling buffalo to like all this pop pop. But the question now is like, are they still in Nigeria at the moment? I thought they have they have gone back. Like I thought they have returned back to Ghana. All those people, all those Ghanaians that used to be in Nigeria then. Like what I what I heard was like was that uh, they've all returned back to Ghana. You know. At the time they were traveling to Nigeria was those days Nigeria economy, Nigeria system was kind of okay, you know, that kind of thing. So many Ghanaians traveled to Nigeria to stay and be doing works, schooling, teaching, building houses and setting up for this buffer. But now I hear that they have all returned back to Ghana. Is that truth? You can drop in the comment what you know about this guys so we just want to react about this whole thing you know <laughs> so in the comment section we are gonna learn more we're gonna see a lot you know a lot of things you know we're gonna see more in the comment guys also uh, make sure you share the video so that you, you get to wider audience so, so that people will see the video too and give their comments yes so share the video guys also give the video thumbs up yes so that youtube will recommend the video to other people in the next video we are going to see another video coming up. All right, stay tuned. Bye for now.